Hello everybody, uh, I've been asked a few questions about how I'd watch a game and how I'd break down uh, some footage and pick out clips from it. Uh, so this is an example from the weekend, Bristol against Bath. Uh, you can see up on the right hand side, this is my basic code window. I use a few different ones, but this is the most simple of them, uh, which is useful when I don't know necessarily what I'm looking for. Uh, so it's a scrum for Bath on the 5 meter line, centre field, um, interested by the setup initially. We've got a, a T setup, which is quite common. Um, so just interested as to how play emerges from there um, and how uh, how they manage to put the play off or not. So initially you can see that it, it looks like a pretty good defensive read. Um, we've got a decent tackle being made. Um, the tackle itself, I'm, I'm, I'm more interested really by the play that goes off the ball, uh, what's caused the, what caused that to happen. So you can see at the back of it we've got two options. Ball goes short, tackle made, then the tack's over. So what's caused that to happen? Uh, on the open side, you can see that body language wise, I says I'm definitely not getting the ball. Center field, you can see body language is really positive. Looks like he's going to be running hard. Decent chance of getting the ball. These guys look like they're definitely not getting the ball right now, which is quite good if it's deceptive. Uh, as the player emerges, just keep an eye on their body language. Still hands in the same kind of position. Still not in catch mode. Not even looking at the ball. Definitely not getting the ball. And then indeed, if you look at uh, scrum half while passing, let's look at where his head is. You can see all the way through, he's only, look, he's only fixed on the ball carrier. So in terms of defensive reads and the information that you've got to take in as a defender, that says I'm not getting, that says I'm not getting. Body language says I'm passing there. Body language says I'm getting the ball. Relatively easy to make a decision uh, if you don't have too much distraction going on.